Farid and Abidin arrive at Sinan's country house, but find only Osman's guard there. Osman says that Senan ordered him to come here and wait. The guard swears he doesn't know anything else. Abidin realizes that Senan has hedged his bets. Ferret admits to himself that he has not forgotten Siren in these two years either. Abidin, after telling Osman what happened to his boss, demands a confession again. And he says that there is another country house 5 Kim from here. Without delay Farid and Abidin rush there. Abidin calls an ambulance on the way. After entering Farid's house, Siren asks to open his eyes. Farid says Siren, how much he loves her and will find her even at the edge of the world. An ambulance doctor. Detects a very weak pulse. Abidin received a call from Suna, who told him what had happened. Ambulances are taking Siren and Senan to the hospital. Relatives gathered. After leaving Siren's room, the doctor says that they are waiting for Siren to wake up and Senan is even worse and it is unknown what will happen to him. Kazim is worried that Sinan will come to his senses and try to harm his daughter again. The doctor says that as soon as Siren wakes up, the police will take a statement from her. Isma thanks Ferret and Abidnam for saving Siren again. Dyer also came to the hospital. Kazimu and Ferret are restless and they go to Senan. Meanwhile, Isla still blames Siren for everything that happened. Kazel reminds his mother that it was she who drove Senan crazy. Mintus tells his sister that Senan will be imprisoned. Ayla asks Mentes and his lawyers to do everything possible to keep Senan free. After hearing this, Farid and Kazim say that it would be better for Senan if he sat down. Otherwise, they will not spare him when he is free. Ayla asks Mentes to do what needs to be done. And Esma begs Kazim to restrain himself, because he doesn't want any more problems. Dyer is waiting for Ferret in the dining room. He apologizes to her for leaving her right at the wedding. Dyer tells him that he did what he had to do, and nothing is more important than a human life. As a lawyer, Dyer says he constantly helps such women. Dyer tells Ferret that he will do everything to ensure that Senan gets what he deserves. Ferret tells Dyer that he will apologize to Ilias and hope that he will cancel everything. As soon as Ferret found out that Siren had woken up, he ran to her room. The doctor asked not to tire Siren, as she is still very weak. But Siren says she is ready to testify immediately in order for Senan to be imprisoned. Siren asked Ferret if he had found her. I found it, Ferret replied and reminded me how he used to say that he would find her everywhere. Saren says she always believed him. Then she asked about Dyar and Ferret told her that they had not married. Suddenly Dyar came into the room and said that the police had come. Dyar tells the police that she is Siren's lawyer. Further, they're making a statement about Sinan. After learning that the police are in Siren's room, Ayla tells Mentes to resolve the issue. Kazel advises his mother to stop and blames her for everything that happened. Ayla reminds me that she helped her. At the Siren ward, Ayla is making a scene. She screams that it's all Siren's fault. 
and she did this to her son. Siren left the room. Ayla says she was playing with her son. And Siren said that her son just couldn't stand the rejection. Next, the police take Sinan's mother away, saying that she will spend the night at the station. Everyone is having a hard time this night, 